Hi, I'm a consultant with the Arkansas Public School Resource Center, and uh, I'm here really today to help our students in Arkansas understand the, all the possibilities that they have. So I'm very thankful that Cheryl Howard, the instructor for the career development class here at Berryville Middle School, and Rebecca Crow from the GOB TV in Harrison to be here to video these students that are actively engaged in the Learning Blade curriculum. I've been in career guidance for about 23 years now and I've used a lot of different systems and done a lot of hands-on activities and, and a lot of internet research. So now when this Learning Blade curriculum was made available to Arkansas, I saw the connection between hands-on activities, focusing on the future, focusing on the high demand careers here in Arkansas. So I see a real opportunity for our students to move from middle school through high school through whatever post-secondary education training that they need. Uh, this is the first year that I've had the opportunity to introduce uh, Learning Blade to my career development classes. I started in the fall of 2016 and um, I've taught 32 years and this is one of the most beneficial programs I've ever used. The purpose for this particular program is designed to help our students and to introduce our students the middle school grade levels, all students, diverse backgrounds, uh, male and female, to introduce all students to these STEM careers. This is a supplemental curriculum, so uh, teachers in science classes or math classes or career guidance classes or GT classes can use this curriculum but it was basically designed for grades 6 through 8 being used a little bit in 5th grade GT it's being used in some career tech classes in ninth grade but it's uh, primarily right now being used very heavily in the career development classes because this curriculum is introducing students to 50 careers in the STEM technology. So it's helping students to relate. They may have a career focus, but they may not know what those related careers are. So as they see the connection between the careers and the technologies and allows them to refocus and then look at the job possibilities and the post-secondary opportunities that they have here in Arkansas or in their area of the state. This is a system that allows the students to connect all of the dots. They see the careers that are related. They see the technologies that are related to all of these careers. They can do the lessons online at their own pace. And so if you've got students that are very good readers, they can read very quickly and, and complete uh, additional lessons of strong interest to them. So we might have a teacher that will assign a particular lesson uh, because they're teaching a math standard or a science standard, but the students can progress further on if they choose to. And classes like career development, it allows those students to choose the mission or the careers that relate to them. It relates to their futures. I believe the purpose and the design of the program is to allow students to be introduced to different STEM careers, the science, technology, engineering, and math. And the way it does that is by allowing the students to participate and choose various missions. And on these missions, they have an objective that they have to solve. And while they are on these missions, they are using various science skills, math skills. Um, they're introduced and they use various uh, background social study skills, as well as reading, writing, literacy skills. I can check the progress of my students. Uh, the Learning Blade program is allied, aligned to the state standards in career development. It allows me to meet additional standards in the areas of reading, science. It gives me an opportunity where students are actually using skills that the other teachers are introducing. And students are realizing the importance of, wow, that skill, that thing that I learned in math, I'm going to actually use that on the job. And it really does apply to real life. And it's making a difference in how my students view these potential careers and the importance of math, science, and 
what they're learning in the classroom. The way that it allows me to differentiate between my students is also in lessons. Lessons that I assign my students, I can assign different students various lessons. It also allows my students to work at their own pace. Whereas many times, say, my resource students might feel rushed. Uh, they may not be able to get a concept when they're introduced in, to it in the regular classroom. When we're working on le learning play, it evens the playing field. They can work at their own pace. It's ideal because it has an audio concept. Um, I also have available headphones, so my students plug in the headphones to their laptops. Um, they're not necessarily observed by any of the other students, so they don't feel pressured. Um, they feel more relaxed in learning, and they feel good about themselves. And it's, uh, they're able to set a goal for themselves, complete that goal, and it makes them feel good. It gives us the choice to advance in whatever our journey may be, even if it may be very difficult. What I find that is unique, as one of my students earlier mentioned, she said, you know, I have a goal, and actually her goal is becoming a teacher. She said, but through Learning Blade, I was introduced to a lot of different careers. Because she assigns these lessons to us, like I would have never wanted to maybe do something about a heart or a prosthetic, because that's not what I want to do when I grow up, or at least not right now. But she kind of opened it up, so now I kind of find those things interesting where I may not have had the opportunity to before. It's an opportunity for me to introduce new options to my students, open new doors. It's a, it's a platform that they enjoy. I think the team working aspect of the project is good because you can bounce ideas off of each other and you can also um, I don't know, get help from them. One of the other projects we did on Learning Blade, it was like on the computer. It was something about a heart. It would read to you and you would like ask questions and stuff. I thought it was really interesting because, I mean, I don't know what I'm going to do yet with my life, but being a doctor kind of seems cool. The STEM careers were touching on math and science and English and social studies. So even if the student does not go down this STEM technologies career pathway, it's helping these students in their literacy and in their math understanding so it's going to help these students at every level of the way for the rest of their lives. Learning Blade is opening the doors to these students and once again focusing on these STEM careers, introducing them, I believe we're going to have an opportunity to get students more excited about science, technology, engineering, math um, as they go into their high school classes.